correct and wonderful people how on a day welcome back to Tessis TV. We don't carry another approval. Come on a domot about waiting the sub for inside palace. As the to everybody the wishes now be say that um Queen Naomi's family is celebrating in Akire. It is a big win for them because all the people that has mocked Queen Naomi that has mocked her mother and her sisters are now coming back to beg for forgiveness. Yes, when Queen Naomi left Palace uh, three years ago, people were blaming the mother. People said that it was Queen Naomi's mother's fault that she did not train Queen Naomi well, that Queen Naomi is supposed to stay even though she knew that Kabiyese had a lot of concubines, that Queen Naomi is supposed to know that he, she is married to a king. People were saying a lot. They were badging Queen Naomi's mother, they were badging Queen Naomi herself. But right now, it is turning out in their own good, in their own favor. Yes, because Kabiyese is dancing to their tune to make Queen Naomi's return a reality. We heard that whatever Akiri elders are saying now that Kabiyese will do for them before taking Queen Naomi back, that Kabiyese doesn't uh, drag it. He agrees everything they said, and he said he would do it to make sure say his wife return back as soon as possible. So right now we heard that the one way is to eat Queen Naomi mother and Queen Naomi herself with her sisters. We say, Kabi Esi don't come and talk, say, he go wed Queen Naomi. Again, remember they had a traditional wedding and they had a court wedding, but they have not wedded in church. Reasons is that uh, Kabi Esi is a traditionalist. Yeah, that according to the custom and tradition of Elefi people, that a king cannot wed his wife in a church. So that is why Kabiyesi did not go further in wedding Queen Naomi in a church after the traditional uh, rituals were done on Mami Tzedenekawo before she came into the palace in 2018. But Kabiyesi wants to rewrite that story now. We heard that Kabiyesi said yes, that if at all Queen Naomi wants him to wed her in a church, that she's willing to do it. All she wants, all he wants is for Queen Naomi to have her way back in the palace. He's tired of staying with his wife separate. He knows he has wronged Queen Naomi in so many ways and he has come back to make amends. One thing I love about Kabiyesi is that uh, he finally betrayed uh, his step after breaking Queen Naomi's heart. But Kabiyesi nearly broke Mommy Tedinekawa's heart because this kind of marriage was marriage that a lot of people were looking up to. Oh, I want to learn to be like Queen Naomi. I want to be submissive to Mommy, like Mommy Tedinekawa. Queen Naomi was so submissive to Kabiyesi. You know why? Queen Naomi said that Kabiyesi is the first man he has ever known. She has not known any man except Kabiyesi. Kabiyesi came into Queen Naomi's life at the perfect time and Queen Naomi did not even have time to date Kabiyesi before getting into marriage with him. So Kabiyesi deceived Queen Naomi into marrying him and Queen Naomi married Kabiyesi out of love, thinking that Kabiyesi will respect that. Normally when Queen Naomi was in the palace, you see Queen Naomi kneeling down, calling Kabiyesi all sorts of sweet name, the husband of my youthful age, Okomi, and all that. Thinking that with all these things I am doing, I will keep my husband without knowing, say, ah, Ashley no go Chris say make Queen Naomi keep her husband though, that Miriam is out there, Adaron K is out there, all of them, many. Because Kabiyesi did not marry all of them, oh. You see Mete Mete at last, you see Empress uh, Madani. They are all forcing themselves on Kabiyesi. They still want to enter palace until all born. They don't say the palace is filled up. So that is it. People were mocking Queen Naomi. People were saying all sorts of things about her and her mother. But now they are the one that laugh last. You know, he who laugh, 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 uh, last, laugh best. And that is Queen Naomi Okunsi. 
She laughs best because she's the one that laughs last. Kabi Isina wants to have Kenaomi back in his arm and he's willing to do anything just to be with Mommy Tedene Kabu. And now Kabi Isina is saying that if at all Kenaomi wants to be wedded in a church, that he, Kabi Isina, will do it just to bring Kenaomi back. And we know the wellers will be wedding wherever they are, especially to Biloba. She's into clothing line and all that. There was a time she saw a wedding dress and said, Kabi, it's you. If you try with Queen Nagomi, you will wed me. And it was a serious matter. She was dragging it. That Kabi is cannot wed Queen Nagomi unless Kabi is want to wed all of them in the palace. But now she's fighting for her position in the palace because Kabi is wants to end it all with her over the paternity. So she doesn't even have time to come and drag anything with Queen Naomi Shidekola. You see that all these Olorins where they fight Queen Naomi, right now they are fighting themselves. Their own karma is knocking at their doors. My correct and wonderful people, I beg go make a great now before we can read this Aproko Dego. Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all according to your time. And it's how I want to take the see this video. Yeah, welcome back to Tessis TV. And we are still on the gist about waiting the stop for inside palace. My current and wonderful fan. So when I see Queen Naomi, I like the way she did do things. I like the way she did compose herself. She's a class lady. Yes. The way she carries herself, the way she does things, make Kabi is to always be attracted to her. Make Kabi Isi to always run back to her. Because if she's an anyhow human being, I don't think Kabi Isi will let her go and reconcile with Queen Naomi. But Queen Naomi never ever come out to say anything bad about uh, Prince Tadenekawa's father. He always praises him. He always say good about Kabi Isi. And Kabi Isi at a time started regretting on leaving Queen Naomi in Akiri. That was when Kabiyesi said, no, I need to bring my wife back in the palace. Whatever it will take me to bring with Naomi Shilekola back, I will do it. And now Kabiyesi is in talk with the elders of Akure and has told them that he is willing to do anything just to have with Naomi back. And at the same time, he told with Naomi, if you want a royal wedding, I will do it for you just to bring you back in the palace. So you see that Queen Naomi is the one winning. Yeah. Why the whalers are losing wherever they are one by one? Because what they expected did not happen. My correct and wonderful people. Now the story will be carried on with this. So I bet me when I can drop your comments. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel. Tell us what you feel about this cabiesis matter of wedding Queen Naomi in a church. And don't forget that all our alleged information we got up from the walls of social media. Please stay tuned for more updates. We'll be dropping from time to time about waiting this up for.